Okay, let's run a simple demand system. We're going to say that the quantity demanded is a function of the price of the good, income, disposable income here, price of uh, complements, cars, and the price of a substitute, transportation. Well, there's our regression. We can see that the constant, the price of gas and income is significant, but there's an autocorrelation problem. Let's do a double check. Yes, we've got a fairly massive autocorrelation problem here. It's a first order autocorrelation. What do we do next? Well, let's correct it. Takes a few seconds there, but we can see we've got two significant variables now, price of gas and income, but the autocorrelation is gone. Notice the R squared is still pretty good. Let's do general to specific modeling. Let's get rid of everything that wasn't statistically significant. So that's just the price of gas and income now. Still got an autocorrelation problem again. Again, let's do a quick double check. Yep, that confirms it. So, last but not least, let's do our autocorrelation correction. And that's our simple linear model for the demand for petrol. Good Durbin Watson, great R squared.